All right, we got Scout. We're going to do her first off lead session here. Good. And the first thing we're going to do is go out the door. I've got her set on a 20. That is my guess for the level that I will need. Um, so the first thing I'm going to do is open the door and let her see it. So the door is open. And you can see that she backed away from it. Good. Being very nice and respectful. She has been uh, running through this door. She doesn't like to stop. So we have been working on this. Excellent. Good girl. Good girl. Yes. Good, Scout. There you go. Good girl. So this is great. I'm very happy with this. And then I can invite her out. Okay. Add a girl and she can come out. Excellent. Good dog. Yes. Good girl. Good girl. Okay. Let's go. So this is her first off lead session. Um, I always prep with a long line. But then the first time that we come off lead, we don't know what's going to happen. So she could decide that she's free and free as a bird and go bolting off. Everything's, there's a gate, everything's fenced. Um, or she's gonna kind of hang around me. Good girl, good scout. Good scout, good girl, okay. And so far she's kind of hanging with me, so that's good. So I've still got her set on a 20, and this is a guess at this level. So I'll go up or down depending on her response. Come on, that girl. Good girl. And I do have my own personal dogs are out in a yard by the vehicles there. Um, they may serve as a distraction. Some dogs don't even notice them. But what I've done is walked up to the top of my yard where I don't do a ton of training. So it's kind of a new place. And then I can start just doing some random um, calling. Good, hey, good girl. Excellent, yes. Good girl, Scout. Um, rewarding her for a spontaneous recall like that. She just comes back on her own without being called. She gets a little treat for that. Um, wait until she's a little bit distracted and then I will do some recalls. Get a cookie in my fingers. Get a transmitter here. And this gets can be a little bit tricky because I really need three or four hands to do this, but we'll see. So all I'm doing is moving around. Good girl. I'm moving around. Good, good girl. Good scout. Trying to put a little distance between me and her. So the further away that she is, the less likely I am to get a positive response here and have the opportunity to show her what I want. Good girl. Good girl. That a girl. Good girl. She's paying pretty close attention to me, so I'm happy with that. The first time that I brought her out on a long line where I, she wasn't, you know, walking right next to me with a leash, she was pretty um, tuned out. She wasn't paying much attention to me. But now she's, you can see, she's sticking pretty close. Scout! Yes! Scout! Good girl! Good girl! So I didn't do any collar pressure there because, mostly, because it's in this hand holding the camera. Um, good girl! Good girl! Excellent! Very good. So I'm going to move out of this area of the yard to a little more distracting space. Let's see what we get. Good girl. Oh, 
Very good. So I'm pleased, very pleased. Good girl. Good scout that she is so tuned in to me because the, the groundwork that I laid before today, I thought for sure that because she really wasn't checking in with me, it's like all the sights and smells were overwhelming her. So she did, she'd learned something from that. So I'm real pleased with that. Good. Good. That a girl. So every single time she moves back towards me, whether it's on her own or whether I've called her, she's going to get a ton of praise and she's going to get a food reward. And that's just going to increase her responsiveness. Yeah, see that? See that? We got some dogs out. Scout! Scout! All right, that's a huge distraction. And she's jumping there, so I gave her a little pressure, as you might have seen. Scout! Good girl! Come on, Scout! 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 That one surprised her. Scout! Scout! Good! Good! That a girl! Come on, good! That a girl! Good girl! Good girl! That was a huge distraction and certainly not one that um, I would have chosen. But we had it. So she squeaked a little bit because she got surprised by the level. I think you could see the level on my... When I was holding it up, I was paying more attention to her than where my hand was. Um, and that does sometimes happen that they get surprised by the whatever level I've got them on. Good girl. Come on. Um, but because of that, I'm going to turn her down a little bit. So typically, if I get vocalizing, I turn my collar down. Good girl. All right. Good girl. Excellent, Scout. Good girl. All right. See that? Scout. Good girl. Good job. Excellent. Good girl. So Andrea is driving out and Scout just did a really nice recall with that. With no pressure. I had the transmitter up underneath my other finger on my other hand. Good girl. So I'm giving her an A plus so far for today because that was way above the distraction level that I would have wanted at this point. So we're gonna say that's a super duper, good girl, super duper response. So I'm gonna walk her back this way. She can see my dogs, good girl. But she's really doing a great job of choosing to stay with me. I don't mind if she goes over there, they're friendly. But um, I just need her to come back when she's called. Good girl. Come on. Excellent. Good girl. That a girl. That a girl. Good girl. Good girl. So that was a very challenging session for her. And she actually passed with flying colors. So um, I'm going to turn my camera off. I think you can see her. She's doing super. 